Well, welcome back into Under the Lights. Hey, it is the regional finals round of the playoffs. I'm Ashley Moore. This is Bryce Bronny B. Bryce Brown Eisen. How many um, nicknames? You have any more? <laughs> <laughs> I do, but uh, I don't know if they're TV appropriate. Wait, oh, wait. Oh. No, let's get to the highlights. We talked about, you know, what happened with Rickland Holmes, Longview Christian winning that state, but we still have a lot of teams in the Humper State right now, including our game of the week, which you were at, right? Absolutely. Two Beast Texas teams. Mm -hmm. Can't get much better than that. And a rematch. Let's get right to it, huh? The Battle of the Bulldogs, part two. This time it's win or go home. Kilgore looking to avenge their earlier loss this year. And we're going to start with a huge play. Chapel Hill fumbles the ball on the goal line on the first drive. And it's going to be recovered there by Kilgore on the one yard line. Huge momentum swing here to start the game because Capital or Chapel Hill was driving. But Kilgore will capitalize. It's going to be Demarion Van Zant taking the snap. Fakes the handoff to Isaiah Ross, and this one's a keeper. Foot race to the end zone. He is going to get the corner. Kilgore strikes first on the quarterback keeper. 7-0, Kilgore Bulldogs. And then the very next drive, this guy was cooking all game long. It's the running back, Isaiah Ross. He had over 100 yards rushing in the first half. Check out the moves here for a first down and more. Little juke move right here. Check this out. Ooh. And he is still going all the way down into Chapel Hill territory. Big run there. But that kind of woke Chapel Hill up right before the half. Demetrius Brisbane, he has the launch codes, and he's going deep, way deep. And he's going to find none other than Deuce McGregor. Bobbles it, but comes down with it. Big catch for Deuce there. Deuces are wild. What a catch. And with 30 seconds left in the half, Brisbane is going to find his big receiver, Cameron Kelly. For a 12-yard touchdown pass, great catch by the big man. And Chapel Hill will tie this one up at 7 going into the half. But at halftime, 7-7, both teams are talking. They want to get that lead right out of half. They want to grab that momentum. But it's going to be Chapel Hill that does it. Check it out. Demetrius Brisbane? Nah, that's him, Demetrius Brisbane. Keeps it for himself, and he has some space. Nobody's catching that, man. See you later, Demetrius Brisbane. 62 yards to the house. The Chapel Hill sideline was loving that one. Brisbane putting the team on his back when they need him the most. As the sophomore puts them up 14-7 midway through the third quarter. And let's check out the final here. Oh, you cannot get much closer than that. But Chapel Hill takes down Kilgore for the second time this year. 24-21. And they'll move on to the state semifinals for the second straight year. Well, they'll take on Bernie next Friday at the Alamo Dome in San Antonio. 